What's going on, Clutch? What? What up, what up, what up? It's your boy Duck. It's your boy Ross. And this is Clutch going. <laughs> Back to you, ladies and gentlemen, of the video today. You feel me? All right, we're going to check out Bride Exposed for Cheating during the wedding ceremony. Now, this. Now, that's rogue, bro. Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't even want to think. Yeah. Where <laughs> where my mind would go to. Like, that's. Oh, that's no. some... <laughs> you, 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 you will beat up a stranger. So I could imagine what you would do. If... But it, nah, man. <clears throat> but it you seemed like it. it seemed like they had the plan and to expose everything in front of everybody. So I don't know, man. This is this is wild, but all right. Someone said Chris turn into and, and then they, Randy. And they didn't finish it. They just said Chris. I got you. We already got it. Go we, we know. All right, we know. We know. Yo, what's up? Welcome back to Alpha Central, I'm your host Jack, and today we're taking a look at wives having meltdowns after getting caught cheating. But let's jump right in, right after you subscribe, of course. Disclaimer, this video was made for strictly comedic slash artistic purposes. No offense is intended towards any individual featured in this video. Hmm. Babe, what are you doing? Oh, uh, nothing. Oh, uh, nothing, cold. huh? What are you looking at? Nothing, I was just on social media. Just on social media. Yeah. Motherfuckers say social media. They don't say what. Yeah, it's they just, were doing you are, on social media. It's like yeah, you're trying you are, to. Mm -hmm. Who says that? <laughs> I was just on social media. Most people that I was on Instagram, I was on Twitter, mm -hmm. whatever. You, you already up to no good. You up to no good. You know good. Uh, what's up? Can I see you? Were just on your phone. Can I see your phone? Huh? You said I was just on my phone. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, I, I've, I've been on my phone. Me too. So, can um, can you pull up what you were just looking at? No. Bro, Why not? Why? You were just looking on social looking media. Why, why are you worrying about it? I was just on social media just looking at stuff. You are just looking at stuff. Mm -hmm. Hey man, just hang it up. You already know. It's up. Up. That mirror in the background really just saved the day. Everyone, please welcome 18 year old Michaela to the Mari Show. And backstage is her ex boyfriend, 19 year old Trevin, and his current and his current 18 year old fiance Katana. Today I'm here to prove that my ex boyfriend Trevin is the father of my seven week old baby Andrew. Trevin and his fiance are denying that my baby is his. But today, they're going to feel real stupid when that test proves that they oh, are wrong. Trevin lied to me and my daughter. He got Michaela pregnant, and then he dumped her to go back to his trashy ex-girlfriend, Katana. I can't stand her. She's terrified that Trevin's going to leave her for me. Once he knows, my baby is his. Oh, oh, oh brother. Nice to see you. Oh, brother. Oh, brother. Of seven week old Andrew Trevin, you are not. Ooh. Wow, she must feel so embarrassed after all that the talk. Usual, usual suspects. Oh no, how could I get Why? that wrong? While she's doing this, I'm definitely hitting the gritty. Yeah, for sure. I'm, uh, damn. Da hey, that's why. Uh, hey, man, you gotta strap up, man. Thanks gotta be sir. careful, man. Gotta be careful. Three years ago, I worked in a call center, and I had an empl a female employee that reported to me, and just very kind to me, just like the type of person you want to help win. She comes to my office. She was like, boss, can I use your phone? I was like, sure. She gets on the phone, and she's like, what? I told you that. Why you did it? And then hangs up. She's like, thanks, boss. And I was like, yeah. Now, this is somebody that was on my team for years. So I was like, may I ask who you were speaking to? She was like, oh, that was my husband. I said, I said, may I give you some feedback? She said, yes. I said, I said, please don't speak to me better than you speak to your husband. Oh, oh, I don't blame you. Damn. That's, that's a bar. That that's cold. Damn. Please don't speak to me better than you speak to your husband, bro. Damn. That is that's a mic drop moment. Yeah. Hopefully she took that advice, bro. Cause hopefully so. Damn. Nobody said even... to tell you that, but that's yeah. It's kind of wild. She shouldn't be speaking to her husband like that. Oh, you ain't gonna let me see your phone, huh? No. Is this the same well, girl? Why, why not? Because that nah. here, that's my privacy. That's my if it's just your friend, let me see your phone. I just okay, want to see. Okay, so is she picking you up? You, am I asking you to use your phone? Is she picking you up? 
So let me see your phone. I just want to see confirmation. No. I just want to see confirmation. I'm... Damn, when you got to do all that, it kind of lets you know. Cut it out. Yep, cut <clears throat> it out. Yeah. yeah. She's going to drop me off. I'm going to take it over there. Wow. You think I'm boo-boo the fool, don't you? I'm not saying that. Like, I'm, just because you, you're thinking, just because you brought me here, you want me to just stick with you? No. I, well, I, you just been, you've been here less than 24 hours. So you're over here sleeping the whole time. Like, What do you mean we just ate a five-star dinner? It's, it's, a, it's a nice night outside. Good to have Why didn't you say let's do something earlier then? You just said we were going to You told me before I went to sleep. Let's just go to sleep. I didn't want you were to convincing me let's go to sleep. That's why you kept feeding me the shots oh. that we got. Damn. No, but in 1942, not. yes. Not you know the what? 1942, uh, too? And you know she didn't help pay. Oh, uh, yeah. So she feeding him the shots to get him to be sleepy so she can kind of. Somebody said know. it's the same girl. Yeah, this it looked like the same. Earlier. Yeah. I don't know. I thought you were talking about the, the video, but uh -oh. yeah, probably is. Who knows? Who knows? I, I see what's going on. I see what's, <laughs> going, on. Real I see what's going on. Yeah. So you can just get your stuff. Go, go, go kick with your friend and don't come back. Yeah, pack your stuff. You want me to get my stuff? Yeah, get, get out of here. You think yeah, I'm going to fool? Yep, gone. Yeah. Peace. Peace. I see the type of person you are now. Oh, wow. Oh, no. I see what, I've been seeing what type of person you are. You think I'm boo-boo the fool? You trying to do that goofy stuff? Yeah, beat it. Beat it. Buster. Oh, my mom's dog. Boo boo the fool. Oh. When you catch a girl cheating on the vacation you took her on? Oh, no. Oh. And he got a sister, too? It look like a sister. The lying from this woman just gets worse and oh, worse as no. the video goes on. It really is. With it. You a different type of disrespectful if you sitting there in the pool uh, with your mate in the on vacation. Uh, Where you thought he was at? It's three o'clock in the afternoon at the pool. I was chilling with my friend. I think he's kind of right, cool. Right, right, right. You a liar. I know yeah, that right. nigga ain't your friend. He trying to hit. Hey, bro. <laughs> You can only sing half of that song. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's crazy though. Like nah, on vacay, damn. So, she, she gonna have to find her way back home. Hey, <laughs> find her way back. Way to ruin a vacation. Uh, I don't care, bro. You always why the f recording me that and I'm not coming back. She is mother. Don't you be cheating on him? I don't give a. I cheat on this mother all the time, but I ain't never got caught doing that. She has no shame I at all. She's kid, shouting bro. to the high heavens. So. You know, I'm overseas. People telling me all the time, they're like, "Man, your girl probably got another man already." And I'm like, "Man, no, I know she, no, she won't. She faithful. She faithful." And now you got this crazy look on your face, like you don't even care about what's what's going on with me. Like you don't, I don't have no feeling. Long distance uh, relationships are extremely to tough, especially them. when yeah. one side is in the military. What's one secret you never told your ex? I got with this teammate. Damn, you got with this teammate. What sport? Skier. It was a better skier than him. Yes. Yeah. He was the better mm -hmm. skier, and when is he the better lover? Undisclosed. I won't say that. You just did. You just oh, did. she finna up. Damn, that's fucked up, bro. I know we were just here, talking yeah. about there's plenty of fish in the sea, but a lot of that fish is turning out to be uh. Spoiled. Uh, spoiled. You just you gotta you gotta search. You gotta throw it back. Yeah, you gotta throw a lot of these fishes back into the into the lagoon. <laughs> I guess the teammate is better than his best friend. That's Check this out. I'm a barber, man. All right. Now when I when I got clients in my chair, she all in the refrigerator, little shorts on, looking all the time. He's you are. And, and, and then hold on, huh? and then hold on, and then hold on, and then, and then not only that, and then not only that, see, but that might help us, <laughs> right? Yeah, it do, it do. Yeah, I, yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. This guy is so funny, I'll tell you that. Who doesn't love a little boost in business? You said you had some sugar daddies, correct? Yeah. So you're currently engaged. You got a fiance, five years, right? Yep. How many sugar How? daddies do you have? It's about it... 10 on and off. 10, 10 sugar daddies on and off. Yeah, I love getting spoiled, I'm not gonna lie. But some are coming out of your roster and some are coming in. Yeah, you know, some people you just vibe with once. Some people just wanna see the experience of what it's like, so they just, you know, hang out with you once, you know, give you some money or take you out to dinner. See what the experience <laughs> so, yeah, is of just giving experience. my money away for nothing. Nah, nah, this is so wrong on yeah, so that's many levels. What? Niggas is, you trying to experience being a... Sh 
streets, the streets, the streets is done, bro. Streets. This is streets is done. Streets is done, bro. This loves the attention. A lot of guys asking me to do the loyalty test on their girl, and this one was way too crazy to pass up. Bro said, "Yo, you trying to DM my girl? She pregnant. She been acting a little crazy and sus. I'm just trying to see if she loyal. The craziness could really just be pregnancy hormones, but I told him to send me her gram, and I got to work. Yeah. I said, you fine as a shit She is. said, "Thank you, with not one but two exclamation points. Slow down, girl." I said, no problem. Where are you from? She said, Oklahoma. Yeah, nice. What about you? I said, I'm from the A. I've never been to Oklahoma. I guess now I have a reason to visit. I'm teaching y'all how to spit game for free. I'm like Khan Academy right now. I asked her if she was single, and she said, eh, it's kind of complicated. I mean, I am, but I just got out of a four-year relationship, so it's kind of a mess. So she's not claiming her baby daddy at Damn. all. I asked yeah. her her number. I said, it's time for me to settle down and add Miss Jackson to my contacts. She gave me her number and snap, and it was time to send bro the screenshots. I sent him the screenshots and said, I hope everything works out. I'm going to pray for that baby. Well, she got set up, but maybe it was for the best. Damn. So she left her phone. She's at work right now. Hi, Samantha, if you're watching. Um, I was going through your Twitter, and I seen all them dudes in your DM and how they were. Well, there's got to be a skit. I think it, it definitely no, girl. Def definitely <clears throat> seems like a skit. Saying, are you single and how you was reading the same book I was reading and you were sending provocative photos to them and you know what did I do you had a boyfriend and you said no I just don't understand Wait. but guess Someone what else. Someone else I do not so yeah. you want to cheat on me yep after I bought you a phone so you can take Man. the truck or I bought you a phone not to text on the dude but to text me and text the family here on then but you wanted to sex other dudes. It's basically if Bobby Hill was black. Got you. <laughs> Let go of my purse. Dude, I don't know. If you. Bobby Hill was black, this is him. Like you're single. Okay, Samantha. Oh my gosh. All right. I charged your phone for you so you can text some more dudes. <laughs> yeah. Go on, text them, baby. Text them. You know how he's swinging the hell. Boy, Girls are right gonna get there. DMs from random dudes, but it's their choice to respond or not. He came to oh. and go. Oh. If you just going and not going, hey, baby, you might need to wait for the church retreat. You might not need to come on this nah, trip. No, you ain't got everybody do what they want to do. I'm pro choice. No, because when you not you when you not pro, you anti. I'm sorry. If you're not pro, you are anti, and what you are not welcome up in here. We are supporters of fuckers and all things above okay we are pro everything this girls is why men do not trust you going on that girls trip what? what's one secret yeah. you never told nah, your ex nah. hell no nah. nah bro you gotta you gotta vet the friends you gotta put them through a rigorous training course of background information and stuff but granted if you do gotta do all that then i can kind of let you know to yeah i shouldn't have to do all that for one to be honest with you so that should let you know I liked his best friend for a while. Did he ever know? Yeah, yeah. He found out? Well, eventually, yes. Did you date the best friend? No. Yeah, I don't know. No, no, no. I, 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 she, she, bu, 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 oh, now you can't speak to <laughs> She didn't like his best friend. No. He did. just liked him. Yeah. She did, she did, she did. She did, she did. So the entire time they were dating, she was just going for his best friend? What's one secret you haven't told your ex? I put mashed potatoes in his front lawn. That's weird. Why? <laughs> to piss him off. Like he was doing some Why? stuff and you're like, I'm going to put mashed potatoes. Yeah, and then it rained. Was he pissed? Yeah, I guess. Is it like his parents' lawn or his lawn? His parents. His parents' lawn, so his dad had to like clean it up? Probably. Oh, you. You. Imagine seeing this in your yard. Ah, <laughs> you stupid. Hey, we need to go outside and talk. Man, okay, cancel this after like fiance it. comments under a post saying she would cheat for a hundred dollars. Damn. How dare you put that on Instagram? Oh, I you. The comment under a post in the Greek with cheating on your husband for a hundred thousand dollars? I care about you in this relationship. I don't think that's real. Hell no, nah, not with the music and all this. Yeah, shit. the Hell music nah. and all that. You gonna take her from work? Come on, brother. Yeah, that's man. That's yeah, too fake. You care about me and you coming up to my job and I can lose my job because you up here with this stupid foolishness. It's stupid foolishness now. Yes, it is. So you would cheat on your husband for a hundred thousand dollars. Make it make sense. Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I love you and own I love you. Not that big of a deal. I'm coming to my job. It's not no big deal. Y'all see. It. This some bull crap right here. Y'all see him. Y'all see him. This is ridiculous. You need to man up. You ain't got no money. You don't have no job. You don't have a hundred thousand dollars. So what does that mean? 
this time that you spending up here, you should be somewhere trying to find a job and be a man. You about to yeah, get here. Definitely. So, oh, Tyler job. Perry. Yes. My, my boss could hear us about a post, a comment. Or you should have never liked the post. You should have never commented on the post. You shouldn't have the time <laughs> to even see the comment, to read the post, to do any of that. You should be using that time to get a job. Well, if you working so much, you shouldn't have time to be posting yeah, and liking posts. You already. How you? How you? How you gonna cancel a wedding without a job? That's all like, I'm saying. The wedding should have never started in the first place. He ain't got no job. That you need to win a job or something. Yeah, like that. man. Marry the That's money you, first, fam. Marry the money first. <laughs> That's wild. I don't care about your post. I don't care about none of that. I care about you. You don't need to be caring about me because there ain't gonna be no me because of this. <laughs> well, apparently not, because you love the money more than you love your oh, own future God. husband. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> yeah, apparently not. Oh, yeah. As much as this sucks, at least he found out before they got married. Dodged an absolute bullet. What's she doing? Yeah, this is what she bullet. doing, yeah? This is what she doing. This is what she doing. Oh. oh. She, 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 she telling me, she telling me that she loves me. She loves me. But thank you, baby. Thank you, baby. Oh, and sending the gifts too. Yes, and then that she sent the same photo. Yo, uh, yo. <laughs> yo. You telling me you loyal? You are telling me you loyal? You telling me you loyal? Oh my God! Oh my God. You, you, you telling me you loyal? You telling me you loyal? You telling me you loyal? Dang, all this guy wanted <laughs> she over there He did breaking. all that because she got she, exposed. Oh, give me my phone. That's how you know somebody getting exposed when yeah, they just aggressive about phone. getting their phone. It ain't even let me let's let's talk about this. It's give me my phone. Straight crazy, bro. All right, you can have your phone. <laughs> <laughs> was to celebrate his girlfriend's birthday with her only to find this use this test to determine if she belongs to the streets guys if she has a messy car or a messy apartment <laughs> women with messy cars and messy apartments tend to have lives that are i don't lie to you the messy car is kind of a mm, messy car in apartment is definitely like a it's trait. like a red flag it's a red flag because it's one I'm not gonna invite nobody over if my crib is like messy. And I'm not talking about like, it gotta be super neat and tidy, but you know, if you got clothes everywhere, you got dishes all everywhere, table and stuff dirty, got a smell to it, it's a problem. You should be oh, cleaning I smell your, anything. You should be cleaning up. And especially even with the car situation, like, you know, it ain't gotta be perfect, but you got, it shows you have some sense of pride for the things that you have. Facts. Because if you don't care, and I come into a situation, I care more about making sure everything look, you know, good and, and taking care of stuff and things look clean. It's a problem because I'm going to feel some type of way like, hey, you know yep. what I'm saying? <clears throat> and I'm not trying to be someone's parent like, hey, you need to clean this up. Hey, you need, like, no, we too old for that. Mm -mm. Very, very chaotic, right. very unorganized. Think about it. If somebody doesn't even take the time to clean up their car or clean up their apartment to make sure it looked nice, something that belongs to them, Especially how before in you the come world would she take care of a relationship? How would she make sure that the relationship is organized? And this goes for men as well. You shouldn't have anything in your life messy. The way you are as a person, mm -hmm. you can tell by the foundation of how you take care of yourself. And if you want a girl that is going to be long-term relationship material, you should not pick her if you're looking at her life and, and something as small as her car or her apartment is so messy, she can't even take the time out of her day to make sure that it always looks clean. She won't be the girl that's trying to make the relationship organized. What do you guys think? Does this mean that's she's a... for the streets? I've been dating this super sweet guy for the last month. He's amazing, sweet, funny, great listener, great career. That's awesome. How was he in bed? Not sure. Oh, you haven't. No, no, this guy is husband material. So I'm making him wait to see if it's gonna work long term. Wait, I thought you were just with some dude last week. Yeah, but that was just for that guy wasn't husband material. So you're making wow. the amazing guy wait, but giving it up freely to the guy you aren't interested in. Yeah. Ladies, what the is this? Do you honestly that's think old. any guy's going to put in the work for something you aren't making other guys work for? As a girl, I sort of follow this odd mating logic, but you have to realize that from the man's perspective, this is complete bull. We're the ones who control the 
equal market. And if you're giving it up free to some guys, you cannot expect another guy to come in and pay a premium. Ah, classic female that's dating one. That's a tough one, but a lot of women do that. I don't understand that logic. Like, if no. you want to deal with somebody, well, when you get to a certain age, you should be dealing with people for, you know, long term anyway. That's at least that's what I would think. Um, and if you are trying to say somebody's a husband or wife material, what's the point of you holding out on them to get your rocks off with the regular other person? Yeah, like, like it's not that's not gonna work. Having your cake and eating it too. That's it. Basically, that's it. That's it. It works. makes sense, but it doesn't at the same time. You're not gonna say my son has flaws. <laughs> <laughs> we can leave. We can leave. Whoa! 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 Whoa!
Don't get me. Get this stupid. Oh, hood. Oh, my mom. I got a five year old child, my. He's lacking attention. I honestly feel so bad for the child. Damn. That just makes things a hundred times worse. That's and so... finally, we have this Chinese groom who exposed his wife for cheating during their wedding ceremony in front of her entire family. Ooh. He did this by playing a short surveillance video on a projector that shows them getting caught. What's even crazier is that she was cheating with her brother-in-law. This is the And at the end of the video, it would have been like a if you have anything else you want to say before it all ends for you, you may want to do it now. GG's. That's wow. fucking wild. Oh my god. Ultimate form of payback and is worthy of a Nobel Prize. Not all wrong. All wrong, bro. He's looking devious. <laughs> you guys have made it to the end. Dog, like, he and pushed her and then just like, you did that wrong, you did that wrong. That's crazy, dog. <laughs> you think I didn't know? And that's how the villain arc did begin. Yeah. Like, Damn, on, man. I, I I hate to see that, bro. Yeah, for sure, bro. But that this. Woo. It's just one of the ones, bro. Lee. Lee. Gotta. Translation, though. He said, you think I don't know? You think I was stupid? You thought I was feeling you? <laughs> Ooh, that's cold, much. bro. That's um, cold, man. That's when he became Homelander. <laughs> but now, nah, man, hey, this was really, really crazy, man. Um, yeah. If y'all enjoyed this one, you already know what to do. Make sure to like, subscribe. Y'all want to check some more crazy stuff like this out on the Rogue page. Hit us up in the comments down below. Hit up that like. Share the videos. Continue to spread love. Be love as usual. Catch you in the next one. Peace. Peace. This bitch is from Houston. If you got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies. Now they hate on me because I'm causing casualties. But why are they after me? Deep inside, they know they can't handle half of me.